I decided that I would join the board of Exbiotech and, and one may ask, well, what were the main reasons for it? And, and it's, it's relatively simple. One is that science and products play a crucial role and the other is people. I think Exbiotech has both working in its favor and the leadership of John and his experience certainly speak for him and he has assembled a, a great team so I think if you look at uh, the products and, and the people it's very promising. At Exbiotech we're really about innovation about ceaseless innovation in every aspect of the drug development process, all towards bringing new and better therapies to patients and reducing the cost and time it takes to get these drugs to market. I do believe that the strength in R&D at Exbiotech is definitely the screening and antibody discovery. And we have a very, very streamlined procedure. We're the only company uh, that I know in the world today that focuses on uh, identifying antibodies that are produced within the human body and clone them with high fidelity and reproduce that as a product. This could be a real game changer in the field of oncology. The traditional oncology medication, you may kill tumor cells, but you're also killing a lot of the patient's own cells. The true human antibody is the first therapeutic antibody that is really seamless in terms of uh, being able to be tolerated by the human immune system without being detected or causing um, bad side effects like anaphylactic reactions or toxicities. The approach, which I think is quite interesting and, and fascinating, is not to look at a pathway and, and then basically blocking a pathway with a humanized antibody, but to look at people who have developed their own antibody against a uh, condition, and then to isolate uh, this antibody to clone, uh, to identify the genes, to clone and to produce this antibody, which is the exact copy of what a human being has done. And that's the specific approach uh, taken at Exbiotech. The uh, products which, or projects which we're talking about and the indications which Exbiotech uh, does focus on are very promising in the sense that there are a substantial number of patients in need around the world, be it with infections like Staph aureus infections, be it with cancer like colon cancer. There are 150,000 patients alone which have that condition and very often diagnosed late. So the, the compound uh, could really uh, make a very positive impact there. We wanted to change the way cancer therapy impacted cancer patients and changed the, the cost-benefit equation. You could have decentralized small production facilities built in a modular fashion, all identical to one another, which is important to guarantee the identical quality of the product made in these different facilities. And in that way, you could serve you know, a large number of patients around the world without having to commit you know, hundreds of millions of dollars or billions of dollars at risk. Exbiotech has added shareholder value, adding multiple clinical trials, developing in-house manufacturing capability, and meeting budget. It's been a remarkable journey. From the manufacturing standpoint, because we try to go for the really simplistic and easy to set up process, we can take that method or that platform and put that anywhere within the world. And we can do it really quickly and really efficiently for a really low capital uh, cost. Um, and that's really where we see ourselves fitting in worldwide. Simpler, flexible manufacturing, small capital investment, etc., will result into significantly low manufacturing cost per gram of uh, protein that is produced. And in my estimation, these are arguably uh, industry best uh, programs that uh, have been achieved uh, or can be achieved at this point. We're, we're positioned to bring a drug to market and have multiple drugs in the pipeline on under $150 million. You know, the average expenditure in the industry is about $6.2 billion. So we've, we've taken a big cut out of the legitimate cost of drugs. A company uses, in some cases, off-the-shelf technology to cut costs and develop better products. 
X Biotech is that kind of company. When I think about X Biotech, I think about uh, innovation that can mean a world of difference in the way an, an entire industry operates. When one looks at a company, one necessarily has to look at the leader of the company, in this case, John. And what impressed me a lot was the background. You know, he has a lot of experience in several companies in the biotech industry, and he has a way where you can feel how strongly he, he believes in the compound, in the future, and how much he cares. That is contagious in, in a company and uh, uh, works. And I would say the combination between knowledge and experience with uh, emotional aspects, and if that is combined in a, in a good way, that goes a long way. I, I believe we have over 100 existing and pending patents in the United States and elsewhere. Uh, our manufacturing process is ready to go and we're waiting for regulatory approval to launch. With this antibody discovery technology, we can work many different aspects, uh, exploiting natural immunity to disease. And that natural immunity can be to your own body's inflammation or it can be to infectious agents. Um, and it gives us a, a really broad range of, of product potentials, virtually unlimited.